I recently celebrated a birthday and got a few items from Dior. And if you want to see what I got, because it's some good stuff, then you definitely need to stay tuned. Hi, and welcome to my channel, Simply Fabulux, where I like to talk about luxury goods, items, a little bit of lifestyle, and then I try to sprinkle in a bit of tips or advice that I've learned to share with you. All right, so before we get into today's video, because it is a good one, I want you to go ahead and like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you can stay informed when I drop a new video because I drop a video every week, all right? Once you've done that, let's go ahead and get into this video. So for today's video, yes, as I've mentioned, you know, I recently had a birthday, yes, turned another year older, wiser, yes, and um, for my birthday, I was fortunate to get some items from Christian Dior. Yeah, I can't say it like the French do, but you know, Dior. Yes, I got some beautiful items from Dior and uh, okay, so normally I don't always share what I get for my birthday, but I thought I'd just go ahead and share, you know, these items, because these are some of the things that I've been really wanting and was fortunate to find, all right? So let's start with my first item. Okay, so the first item that I got from Dior comes in this beautiful box. So, and you know, I'm not the one to always say guess what's in the box. I'm about to show you right now. So you don't have to worry about guessing what's in the box. But yes, it is an item that I love and so glad that I got. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and open it up for you guys. <laughs> And I have mentioned that, you know, when something like this speaks to me, I have to get it. So yes, what I did get and was like fortunate to find because it's probably like the last item. I mean, maybe there's another one, but it was already hard to find. And it is this beautiful hat with like a veil, but it's in leather. So I've seen this hat before, you know, in the stores recently, but they're usually like that wool or like cloth, some type of like, either like a wool or cashmere or like wool and something else like, you know, woven into it, but it's not an all leather cap. And it never really has this Dior imprint. This is really from like an older season, but a store just happened to have it. And I love it when that happens where you can just like, you know what, this store actually carries it. It's like the only store in the US that has it. And take this out of it and I love the whole like veil detail even though it does not come off so you can't like lift off the veil thingy but it's like a part of <laughs> the design and if you know how many hats I have with this like detail from just other designers you will know that I really like this detail when it comes to like a hat so yeah this is the it's called like the Paris Revolution cap. So I can't remember. I don't know if this is from like their early 2023 collection or maybe even fall 2022. I'm not sure and I don't care. I'm just glad that I was able to purchase it and find it perfect size. I will even try it on right now. Ooh, yes. Oh my gosh, I'll look in the viewfinder to see what it looks like. But yes, this hat will be worn because um, I love a good hat, you know? I have ideas for this hat. I have outfits that could go with this hat that I will wear. So it's not one of those throw on and just go, like I'm going to the grocery store. It's more like, I'm gonna style it up. I'm gonna dress it up when I wear this hat. But yeah, this is the hat. I love it and thought I'd add it to my collection. and. You know, just just in time for my birthday. Love this hat. To put it back in its box with the tissue in there, so it can keep its beautiful shape and doesn't collapse on me. But yes, 
my Dior hats. Now the next item, <laughs> again from Dior, and this is actually a ready to wear piece that I have been excited about. It's part of their essentials collection, so it's like always in stock, but I have been wanting this piece since like forever, since they produced it. I just, you know, I had to wait for the right time and I thought the birthday or my birthday, it's the right time. All right, so let's go ahead and open it up. I haven't worn this. I mean, I have looked at it, but the plan was to wear this on my birthday, but I ended up wearing something else, so. But this shall be worn, trust me, okay? And let me show you what I got. <gasps> yes, it's from their, like I said, their Essentials Collection. And it is knitwear. So the only thing about knitwear, you do have to be careful when it comes to the care of it because you have to dry clean it. Do not hand wash it. Even like dry cleaning it, you gotta be very careful. But yes, this is their knitwear top. And it literally just says Christian Dior on it. And I got the one that's in cream with the like navy blue writing or the navy blue stitching or whatnot. I think I want like a size up. Normally I can go like a size down to like maybe like a 38. But I think I want up a few sizes because when I tried on the 40, it fit fine but it was like just around my arms where it felt a little snug but with this like it's just a little bit looser just because i know like after you know you wash it and or i shouldn't say wash it please don't wash your knitwear because huh just don't make the mistakes that i've made that's why i'm trying to give y'all tips and advice do not <laughs> try to put this in the washing machine like even when you try to hand wash it like really be gentle really like i can't advise you enough that's why i just try to leave it with the professionals to dry clean this or take care of it because i have ruined so many knitwear by trying to like wash it by hand or um put on the gentle cycle in my washing machine you know and then let it like air dry mm -mm. just just leave it to the professionals if you know like you're not really good when it comes to knitwear cashmere anything that's really delicate just leave it to the professionals or just, you know, stay away from it. Cause I know I stayed away from cashmere for a very long time after I ruined the most beautiful cashmere sweater that I've ever bought. But anyways, that's another story. But yes, this one, I did go up just a little bit of a size. I think I want to kind of like either two sizes, just the way that I wanted it to fit. Um, I wanted it to be a little bit more slouchy, but it's still, it's still fitted, but yeah. So that's what I got and I, again, I have been eyeing this for the last some years <laughs> and decided to pull the trigger, especially after I got another knitwear from Dior, like my pink top and I've been able to like really maintain and keep that one. I was like, okay, I think I can like graduate and get another knitwear. This is like the second knitwear piece that I own in my collection only because of, you know, my fear of ruining knitwear because I have done so, so many times in the past. So don't be like me. Don't ruin your cashmere, your knitwear. And if you know you have like a hard time keeping up with it or you don't like to go to the dry cleaner that often, just don't even bother. Just save your coins, all right? Okay, so that is birthday gift number two. Now birthday gift. Number three is in this small box. So it is a jewelry item. Now this one I haven't actually opened, but I mean, I knew what it was. So it was like the only jewelry piece that I got. All right, so yeah, let me go ahead and open this one up for you guys. Take off the ribbon. And I have something very similar to this, but I wanted to get it in another shade of gold. So that's what I have got in here. If I can open this box. Okay, so this is their classic CD earring. 
and I originally got this specific piece prior in yellow gold so I wanted to get it in you know white gold or the silver and it just has like the crystals in there and again it's just a regular CD but I love it I love the one that's in gold that I have that I'll wear quite often and I thought it would be great to just have this in like a white gold it is fashion jewelry or costume jewelry so you do have to like take care of it just to make sure that the stones don't fall out and it doesn't like start to tarnish so I always try to wipe them down after I use them or after I wear them it just helps it last longer according to the tag it just says is rhodium in white this is what I got if I can show it to you I did get this it's a set of two so the other one isn't here so it's not like I just got uh, one pair I got comes with um, or one earring I got two because it comes with a set of two yeah one earring for both ears now the next item that I got I've kind of already opened this so because I had to try it on to make sure I got the right size and everything and these are shoes so I have been wanting the D-Way slides from Dior but with the crystal on it. So that is what I got. But I don't know if you can see the crystals. It should kind of like shine a little bit. But yeah, I got the slides with the crystals on it in black or the shoes are in black, but the um, crystal is like the silver white crystal crystals. I think they call it strass to be honest. I think it's called strass instead of just crystals. The shiny sandals, the shimmery shiny sandals is what I got. So yes, cannot wait to wear these like, you know, in the spring because it's actually not, I mean, although it's cool weather here and it does get like sunny, I think I will wear these in the spring when I'm, you know, wearing sandals. So spring, summertime, this will be perfect to wear. So I'm not going to try anything on today. I don't normally do like mod shots so you can kind of see it on. Now I did try on the hat for you so you did get to see that but I didn't try on the shirt or the earrings or the shoes. <laughs> I just wanted to just give you a peek of what I got. For my birthday let me know leave a comment below which one did you like you know is there something from the collection that you've been thinking about or is there something from dior that you want for your birthday or have been thinking about for your birthday was it any of the items that i got for my birthday leave a comment below and just let me know i would love to hear and you know what if you stayed to this part of the video go ahead and like the video, subscribe to my channel, and hit the notification bell so you can stay alerted when I drop a new video. Since you've made it this far to the video, I do wanna say, you know, thank you for watching, thank you for supporting, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.